Hello, and this is my first look at Scribble Noughts Unlimited. And um, so I actually know pretty well nothing about this game. So this is like a very great um, first look. I'm going to be doing a let's play. I'll play one level if there's a level system or whatever. I'm going to go start. Our story begins Ooh, does with it. Grandpa Edgar and Grandma Julie. Yeah, I love Grandma Julie. You might not believe this, but Grandpa Edgar used to be the world's greatest adventurer. Oh, yeah? Grandma Julie would beg to differ. <laughs> she was also an adventurer. Edgar would often brush away vines or open doors thought to be undisturbed for generations, only to find Julie was already there having lunch. Looks like a monkey. They competed like this on adventure after adventure. On one adventure, Julie beat Edgar to the top of a long lost pyramid. Oh, did she? Because she could just randomly have a car like that. What she found was an engagement ring. Oh, snap! The two of them semi retired to start a family. And they continued starting that family until they had 42 children. Oh, well, somebody got busy, didn't they? One day, That's Mom great. and Dad gave Maxwell and me two amazing gifts. The first. <laughs> Was a Earth. globe that let you travel anywhere in the world. Oh, cool. The second was the most amazing notebook. This notebook let you write any word in it, and poof, the word would come to life. Oh, so that's how they had all their kids. Well, that's just a fun time then, isn't it? They didn't even get to have the fun. Our parents were worried about us turning out to be spoiled little brats. So they sent us out to face the challenges of the outside world. Oh, of course I did. On the road to the city, we ran into an old man who said he was hungry. <laughs> Pedo. Maxwell made something to give him, but he played a nasty trick. The apple was rotten. Oh, the old man spat it out as soon as he tasted it and was very, very angry. Oh. As he cast some sort of magic. He called us spoiled little kids, and then disappeared. It didn't seem like anything had happened. But when Maxwell turned to continue down the road, I couldn't follow him. The old man had put a curse on me that was turning me to stone. We didn't know what to do. Luckily, our brother Edwin's farm was nearby. Boy, you should have seen how angry Edwin was. He couldn't believe what we did to the old man, and said we probably deserved what we got. Lucky for us, Edwin knew about starites. Oh, yeah? Starites are magical objects born out of the happiness of others. <laughs> when you do enough things to make others happy, you will find starite. Yay. Hopefully, if Maxwell used the notebook's power for good, he could collect enough starite to remove the curse. Maxwell said, that's it! I'm gonna go out and do good things for all the people I can find. I'm gonna get all the starites in the world and Wow, that's so cheesy. Better, Lily. So Maxwell no. his notebook headed for the door. That he did, and this is where the game starts, I, I reckon. Uh just nice fade to white. Oh look, there's like this little dude. Now okay. I I don't really even know what I'm doing. Walk to the farmer. Well, uh, okay, so right click and you get like this little camera and you can look around. Do I have to click on the... Oh, I have to click on the farmer. Come closer to start me. Okay, so there's Wasset. It's It tells you to click, but the controls are actually WASD. Spacebars jump. Um, shift doesn't really do anything. Star right, the basics. Alright, whatever. Earn a star right by helping Edwin with his award winning pig. Yeah. Okay, so there's uh, apparently like little uh, mini game things. A run of litter into an award winning pig. Write an object to help Maxwell scrub the pig. Okay. So I gotta use the notepad, it's up here. Um, write an object. Cleaning. Okay, that is really cool. 
Give it to this bloke. It was Maxwell the pig. No. Give it to that bloke. Come on, mate. Take the brush. Do I have to scrub the pig? Maxwell is the pig. Oh, no. I'm Maxwell. Oh, far out. Well, there you go. Clean. I clean the pig. For the current hint. Oh, that's kind of strange. Drag this to the trash can. Pig looks great. Now use an adjective to increase the pig's size. Uh, okay. Um, wait, so I click it? Oh, right. Adjective. Huge. Oh, there you go. To create wings large enough to carry the pig. Okay. So I click it. I, I need wings large enough to help me fly. So it tells you what it wants. Now I have to create an object. So massive wings. How about that? Magic backpack stores objects for later. Throw the wings in the backpack and wait for the judges to arrive. Cool. Yo, diggy dog. Okay, so I get my wings out. Drag these to the lower right corner. Uh, so I let go. Now I chuck them on the pig. Now it's a giant flying pig. Blah, 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 blah. Well, that's the way to go. When you don't want to pay somebody to write a script for you, um, just, you know, get people to just go blah, 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 blah into the best game ever. No, I actually really am enjoying this. This is quite fun. Uh, apparently I got three three stars up the top here, and uh, that means that uh, I did good. So what do I... Let's remove the wings, chuck them in the... Where's my trash can gone, mate? Cool, I got a star, and my dude like did a little bit of a flip. And I got one star right. Continue. Oh, well, that's cool. And shards by helping people, ten shards will form a star right. Use star right vision to find shards. Okay, so how do I do that? I click on that. Ooh. Okay, help a spout to grow. So if I create an object, watering can. How about that? Give it to this bloke. <laughs> wow. Well, that's a fun time. Let's get away the other shard opportunity. Reset the level to return all objects to their original state while keeping your own shards. Okay. Alright, so you can reset the level. No pad can create many things for Gary. Copyrighted materials and proper nouns are not allowed. Uh, Alright then. So, um, coming up to like 10 minutes or whatever, so I'll stop the video here and you can watch me play episode 2 by clicking on episode 2. Okay, bye!